Played in a band called the Great Dismal. George and Karen played in Thanks. We talked about the origin of Padfoot. The literal origin of Padfoot was me and Karen going to see the Wonder Years at the Norva. Yep. And afterwards, I said, "Karen, we should be in a band because our both our bands were defunct at this point." Yeah. And I was like, "Yo, you want to be in a band together?" And she was like, "Yeah." I was like, "We should call it Padfoot because we talked about this before." Yeah. And like I hate to just like reference Harry Potter, but it's fine. Like whatever. <laughs> and she was like, "Yeah." I don't, know, I don't know who started the conversation. I think it was you. Yeah, yeah I was legit just like, let's fucking put Thanks and Great Dismal together. Like, these are all, like, my favorite musicians, like, the ones we can grab from these two bands and just, like, do it because it, we enjoy doing it and we're not going to let anyone stop us from doing it. I went with a bunch of people in 2014. And it was the best weekend. And then I was like, it'd be cool if we played Fest one year. And then and then mine and George's band at the time broke up. <laughs> so we're like, well, there goes that dream. And then and then we started Padfoot. And then uh, a lot of our friends, we saw a lot of our friends were playing Fest. And we hit up Randy from Mikeme. And we we're like, how do we get on Fest? And uh, they're like, just email, send an email here. And uh, we asked nicely. <laughs> It's very surprising um, that if you put out music that's good, that people will want to listen to it, and then, you know, you just end up in Florida and uh, playing, playing gigs. Skateboard! <laughs> uh, Anderson is a phenomenal guitar player from Pictures of Vernon. And how do you know Pictures of Vernon? Well, they played our first show, and subsequently... It was their first out-of-state show, too. Oh, yeah. And yeah. subsequently, we also played every out-of-state show we played. So. Oh my god, yeah. So Karen, you're playing in 38 minutes. Fuck! How do you feel? I almost threw up. <laughs> um, I was very nervous, and I and like I don't really get nervous for Padfoot shows that much anymore because I, I don't know, my parts aren't that crazy. I just do like kind of the same thing for every song. <laughs> straight to tour again so I think they landed in New York and then they drove straight down to Atlanta yeah, they were super late but like of course because that was such a, they went on an incredible journey honestly though <laughs> like given like everything that had to happen for them to get to Atlanta they showed up <laughs> with like about one negative minute to spare. Yeah. oh yeah like, yeah they showed up like right on time because I didn't have a kit and then they ripped a gig. Seth Carolina was cool.
cool as hell because we had a show somewhere in Boone. Boone? Okay, I knew it was in North Carolina, but I can't remember. And it got dropped, and we were like, fuck. And then Anderson just, like, asked nicely. <laughs> That's the theme. If we could play on this really cool show. It's so We asked nicely, and we got to play that show, and um, that was just so cool. Because, I mean, I'm a big fanboy of Future Teens and Oceanator, so it was just like... I just love to watch, and like, of course they all ripped, and then we got, we also got to play, and they were like, we were like, thank you so much, and they're like, we don't care, this is great, like, this is fine, of course, and we were just so nice. Milestone Club. Yeah. Which one is Milestone Club? Charlotte. The, Charlotte. With what Fox it like? Fox the one, oh, the one right. like that place one. was cool, it was, yeah. but it was cool, I really liked it, it was very much like, you walked in, you're like, alright, that, that's, that's what the vibe is tonight, like, it yeah. is dark, oh. it is dark in here. I... <laughs> I can't explain like how weird it is to like walk in somewhere and see like five people sitting at the bar like the bartender's like okay you guys are playing and I'm like yeah and then what 20 minutes later it's like 70 fucking people <laughs> it, was like, it, was it was just like out of nowhere and everyone there was so cool and like yeah. so like gracious and just like it was just a fun time <laughs> idiots were like, we can't get POV on the set because it's just like too long of a bill. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a <laughs> battle set where it's half fat foot, half POV. This is a song. Young Daniel are just <laughs> looking at each other in the eyes like star-crossed lovers. Oh, I'll never leave my house. This band isn't like it's not like a an individual's project. Not only through the music, but like in the day to day. Like, these are my best friends. You can't fucking replace that with anything. Yeah. <laughs> My best friend right now. <laughs>